Are we recording? I think I'm recording. So, what is going on, everybody? Welcome back to the channel today for another video. And today it's going to be something new that I have been wanting to do for a long, long while. Now, I'm not going to lie. Career mode on English. I've been speak speaking about this on stream like a month ago. I was going to do this because I, you know, if you've been following my channel, I do career mode on Swedish and I do the um, the World Cup. That could have been scary. I was about to like write over my Swedish uh, career mode, which would have been not so good. Uh, and I, I do like the World Cup journeys on English. Uh, with Currently, Italy did it previously with Serbia, and I'm about to do it with Australia as well. But I spoke in about earlier that um, I was going to do career mode, but not with a high-rated team, you know, like United, and like something with some Parma, you know, because Parma is also interested since, you know, They've got minus five points to start with in the Serie A because they're like one player wrote to their own to their his like former teammates to take a chill, take it down a notch in today's game. And you know, yeah, if you are, if you haven't heard that story, go 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 read it, whatever. Um, or you know, Stoke City you got relegate mission, save Stoke. Don't worry, guys. This won't be the only career mode. I'm just doing this to like first of all, and then to decide which. Which team should I really go with, you know, for career mode? I'm doing, obviously, Manchester United, since I do cheer for Manchester United. Obviously, yes, I am from Sweden. Uh, I cheer for Hammer being Sweden, but when it comes to, like, another team than just, you know, Sweden, it's definitely Manchester United for me, you know. And I'm not, like, saying, oh, they're good, you know, because they're not really that good anymore. Um, Yeah, we're good, you know. We go to Champions League, we perform, you know. Premier League he came second last season, and uh, but it's not. I really do support Manchester United, uh, and I want to do career mode because with them because last time I did with Manchester United was like two years ago on the YouTube channel FIFA FIFA 16 I think it was and I did finish it, so I really do want to finish it. I mean don't worry. I mean if you if you're like here and we've been talking about this on stream, you know don't do with these kinds of teams. It's, this is not only going to be the only career mode, so speaking. And we won't play every game, guys. If you're new here and you know excited for it, we won't play every game. We'll simulate a couple of games. We'll play a couple of games. Probably the Champions League games, you know. And career mode for me is basically, you know, about doing the team that you might want. And when I sell the players, that doesn't necessarily mean I don't want them on the squad. I just want to try something new. I want to like, okay, we got Sanchez here for an example. Yes, we could keep Sanchez. I want Lukaku in the squad because I, I am thrilled of his performance in the World Cup. He scored goals, he was looking good. He's got like a little bit of critics. Uh, obviously every player gets critics in every season probably but uh, for his performances but maybe people are finally realize amongst myself you know that he's not very he's not that bad you know he's good when he does the role that he should be doing you know scoring goals. Um, we got Pogba you know won the World Cup. It's rumor says that he's like wanting to go back to Juventus which is absolute mental. We got Sanchez. I'm thrilled to see this guy now. He hasn't had the World Cup. He's so he. Lo I mean, the first game he looked. I mean, the first that I get watched during the preseason where you play. Uh, no, not America. Sorry, the second one, the San Jose Earthquakes. You know, he looked kind of you know on it. You know, like he really wanted to be there. Anthony Marshall. I'm quite so shocked. Like he's still on the team. I thought he was gonna, you know, submit a transfer request. Matic looking forward to play with him. Uh, Jesse Lingard. Like I'm gonna. Have so count up some players that might actually leave the team when I'm, you know, in charge of it. It's Jesse Lingo, Herrera, Smalling, Valencia, Ashley Young. And it doesn't mean that I don't want him on the team. I have such massive respect for Valencia. such a, like, role mother when it comes to, I don't know, just playing every second. Don't diving. You know, if maybe does I, I mean, for me, you know, as you know, I, I just love Valencia. He's such an incredible athlete for me. Uh, okay, I'm not gonna like say about actually Young, he's trash talking a lot, you know, but uh, Lindelof, absolutely gonna stay in the team since I'm Swedish and I really appreciate Lindelof in the Swedish national team. I've always, I mean, yes, the first couple of weeks, months in United looks kind of shaky, but it's been growing and performing a lot better, uh, better lately. De Gea's obviously gonna stay, no doubt. Mata might leave, Bayer's gonna stay. Rashford, Martial, question marks, Shaw, probably not, you know, I don't wanna be, I uh, love Shaw, like, good, good player injury a lot uh, but you know the season where when he got injured like in the beginning of that season is probably the best player in Manchester United for me so quick so agile so on it 
every single second and got that massive injury sort uh, very sad but I don't like I won't probably use someone to buy a new fullback and maybe get him out on loan loan um and I want to recall Pereira from Valencia I think is that right to play him you know there so there's a lot of fun things for me that I want to do and obviously this series is not only about me um playing with Manchester United dis disgusting about man d discussing disgusting discussing about Manchester United it's all also for you the viewers the the people that I'm familiar with in streams the people that hasn't been on this channel before um you know friends also you know to comment like what do you guys think we can have good discussions about we can have good comments we can have you know so I can take in the next video what do you guys think about the next season um the Maris signing the uh, signings that Arsenal Socrates Leno good defensively is that what they miss you know uh, Liverpool bought a new goalkeeper finally Curry's is having a tough time what do you think about all that Curry's debate not only the Champions League you know he's also struggling currently which is awful you know because of all the hate that he get that he gets um they bought Kaita as we already knew season before this Fabinho is already in um is there more incoming you know there's there's so many things to discuss now Jorginho going to uh uh, Chelsea instead of Man City because of the Napoli. Sorry, I don't really know his name. He's going to Chelsea, following up. Um, we'll sit to win it, win it again. You know, back to back. There's so many things to discuss, guys, and I don't really know where to begin of of it all. So hopefully you can you can um, you want to write something, you know, question me about something, you know. So there's a lot of things to discuss. Uh, so what we'll do first, guys, is go into the, the squad hub. And we will sell the place that I want to sell, uh, basically. Um, so Valencia is going to to go. Cause I I want to try like a new fullback. Uh, Balling is going to go. Rojo, Jones, Young. All the players that has been like in United for a long time, basically. <laughs> Young has been here for ages since the Aston Villa movie, you know. Uh, Matt is not going to go, but Mata is going to go. Uh, Fellaini, he can be on the squad, like, why not? This this one is interesting, however, because Pogba is like, yeah, I could keep him, but if he's really rumoring to go for another squad, why not try and sell him and buy something? Yeah, he's massively talented. He's massively crucial to the team as well. But I'll leave him for there right now. Uh... And these players like rush for the march. I'll just I'll just knock him out on the transfer list. And if they don't sell, they don't sell. We might use him, you know. Uh, a recall Pereira. I really want to use that Pereira. Uh, Jesse Lingard, yes, might get sold. Uh, and the rest will be keep kept. So guys, that is going to be interesting to see how many players that might actually get sold. Um, I'm hoping quite some bits actually, just just for fun. Uh, Borfik Jackson want to play? Yeah, absolutely, man. It's all about the the preseason. Where is Borfwick? Where is Borfwick Jackson currently? Where is he? Borfwick. There we go. Sixty-seven rating. Why not? Um, and yes, obviously, guys. Sorry. Like all these comments that you write, it doesn't necessarily have to be about the Premier League. It can be about the Serie. A, you know, Parma being minus five points. Uh, Juventus signing Cristiano Ronaldo. It could also be about the La Liga. It could be about the Bundesliga. Liga, uh, whatever you want to talk about, you know, I'm open because I am. I don't know ev everything. I c probably don't even know like 20% what's going on. But it's just not interesting to like learn things and discuss it with people that has the knowledge to talk about it. And we're gonna skip it through. And R Romelu Lukaku scored the only goal in this game. Uh, so th there are so many fun things to, you know discuss about when it. You know, because this preseason and the World Cup just ended, like everyone's oh depression, depression, depression. You know, oh the World Cup. So what should I do? Oh, oh, it's international football cup. What the bloody hell are you talking about? International football cup? No, no prime players playing, but but it doesn't necessarily. I am happy that United doesn't have like Pogba and San, uh, no Pogba, Romelu. I want like the young players to get play time. I want them to really try and fill the pitch as they always do in, before they go on loan. I w Pereira, please, Mourinho, don't loan him out. Please, man. Like, I can't. He's been loaned out, loaned out, loaned out, you know, every single season. So, do you have any, do you recognize this from your team that you cheer for, you know, support? Like, oh, no, please don't get, don't sign him in. Oh, no, don't loan him out, you know. There's so many fun things to talk about. Matic, surely equalize a minute. 
and uh, that's it from that game uh, yes for today guys only gonna be like simulating the tournament uh, and uh, oh transfer off for Juan Mata right we will negotiate with uh, Chelsea who wants him back right interesting want to propose a new one because his current value is like 21 could we go for 31 Oh yeah, we got the deal, can't it? <coughs> Herrera for um Right, okay. Um so yeah, uh, Herrera got an offer um and I didn't like accept it at at start, you know, I wanted to uh, take it easy there, like negotiate with him. See all in the last game. Surely we should win this. Yes, five or Pogba with two, Valencia with one, Lingard with one, and Sanchez with another. Um, so yeah, five goals to nothing there. That was good. Good game, guys. Good game from the team. Uh, transfer offer for who? Andrea? No. Uh, so now it's like. A the question of signings obviously I'm gonna have a say in this obviously you guys are gonna have a say in this like I won't be the only one deciding the signings like it won't be like I'm watching a YouTube right now just talk about a nice skills he's doing the rebuilds you know for a hundred thousand yeah a hundred ten uh, that, that is awesome it's like great series that's not gonna be like this you know it's not gonna be like this if you watched it so we'll actually do like 10 episodes so you will have a say in the signings sort of speaking um, just so you know but I will try and sign a player and the, the player that I will try and sign for the for the first signing it's gonna be someone linked to Matic in the national squad that has been linked a little bit during the summer to uh, to Manchester United a player that I actually enjoy watched during the World Cup just, just I don't know why it's just I just don't know why but he has been uh, really good in the series as well obviously um, so it's gonna be Sergio Milinkovic Savage from Lazio guys 83 rated on this work no <laughs> on the career mode um, I think it's gonna be like 85 86 in the next game and it's probably going out to be sold um, this summer most definitely people would as would I have a hard time believing he's staying in Lazio sorry for that but it's just you know that's how I feel like it but it um, could swap Pogba nah. we could swap under Herrera however I would definitely go with that one right winger Just right wing it. Like if we were to have like Sanchez and the right wing uh, or match they would be like, oh, we want our left mid. Is that alright? And then we have like a bronze player on there, you know. So foot mil, how are we doing with that? Uh, can we like meet each other, you know, on uh, halfway mark maybe? This is some intense, intense purchasing of a player. Oh, okay. Savage, cool. Negotiate with Savage will do now. Um, are you seeing his current age? That is nothing. Is it? Is it? No, no. Is it? No, 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 no. Okay, I'll take it. Okay, let's take it. No, I'm not. Neither am I. We're like we're so close to it. Savage. We're thinking the same. I like. I like. Where's this guy? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Six. Yo, you can get a lot more money here. Oh, and a hundred thousand. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. So we 
do it. Savic! Let's go! United has just signed Milikovic Savic, which will be an awesome addition to the team. Herrera, I'm sorry mate, but you will be sitting on the bench. And Savic is on this one, he's on the squad. Uh, so what we'll do now, what I want guys for you to let me know is centre back, two full backs in the right winger. That's four positioning, four positions that we got here. Uh, I could easily like go around thinking my head of full backs, uh, right winger, uh, and a centre back. But I want you guys also to be maybe during this time, you know, I think about someone. But I want you guys to be involved, very much involved in this, and hopefully you will want to be involved in this as well. So we got new transfer office. We have got for. Herrera, 29, okay. Loan, yes, yes, yes. Definitely. And Rashford for... No. Uh, reject. What wants some more for that? They didn't even like, have the energy to negotiate with Inter, inter you know. Uh, that was just straight up banter for my, for my friend. Is probably maybe watching it. All right. W Valencia in the last... I think this is the finals, hopefully. They got Garay, Rio... Um, who's like, I'm thinking about Mina, but Barcelona just purchased him, didn't he? Oh, wait, Mina's there, so maybe we can buy Mina as a centre-back. And we lost? What? Alright. Uh, so maybe we can purchase Mina as our, our centre-back, you know, he's linking up with, uh... Because I'm thinking something new in, in the defence, uh, so to speak. Alright, guys, uh, change, change plans here. I don't want you to think about full-backs. Okay, it's alright to think about fullbacks as well, but I want to f you to think about left wingers, right wingers, right mid, left mids. Okay, uh, because I'm I'm going to try and sign Mina here uh, from uh, from Valencia, and then you can think about all the other. Oh no, what? How many minutes are there? Like 150 minutes? I don't get it. How is this even a g thing? You know, that they have a mean as well. Can we even? No, of course not. All right. Um, so what we'll do is basically do something interesting for this career mode. Oh no! I know what we're doing. I definitely know what we're doing. This guy. We're gonna try and buy Rafael Varane to uh, United. That's what we're gonna try and do, guys. And mate, Pavard is also interesting, guys. So like, if you. If you're interested in like uh, writing like oh sign Pavard, I would be into that or Hernandez or you know uh, so there's a lot of plays to go with but we um, like the co the coins <laughs> I was going to say the money we 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 will get it if you like if you give me options we will g try and get that money um, through to uh, to uh, to buy the players for so, you know write whatever you want guys uh, we'll probably find a way. I'm laughing currently inside myself because I have like an insane suggestion. Um, I am currently. This is this is quite funny, you know. Like, what would happen if we were to sign Mohamed Salah, who's apparently only 25 years old? What? He's young. He's very young. Mm. Like what would happen if we were to try and sign Mohamed Salah as a United player? Oh, they are not want. They don't want him to leave. All right, I get it. Okay, okay, Liverpool. Okay. Oh yeah, this is oh, okay. Now I get it. Okay, this is because they just signed him, right? And it's the next season, or probably. Okay, yeah. Okay, I get it. Yep. That was interesting, though. Like. Um, uh, Rocha is sold. Herrera is sold. Where's that? Ver How's it going with Varan? Any progress on that Varan? Doesn't seem like it. Doesn't seem like we've got any progress with Raphael. How's it going there? We need. Maybe we need to go like interfere here. 
Do we need to interfere? Alright, no actions available. Um I'm thinking about like Manolas as well from uh from from Rome. From Roma. Twenty six years old, he's not very old. He's eight five rated. Like that's a good signing. So that could also be a potential uh, centre back that we buy to the squad. Uh right. So yeah, uh, but guys, we are very close to the end of this uh, today's video. Um, no real, no real. Oh yeah, we bought Savage. Obviously, we sold a lot of players. I can't even remember how many we sold. Uh, but comment, guys. We, who do you think we should buy? Right mid slash right back, left mid slash left wing, um, centre back. Probably find out myself. Uh, yes, there we go. We, we are probably going to sign uh, Costas Manolas here from Roma, and we are going to end it off this episode with some negotiation for Manolas in this last second of the episode, guys. Uh, I want to say it's absolutely crucial, and Manolas agrees. And yes, we would. Much love to have you on a five year contract. Do we want to disregard it? Except. And there we go, Costas Manolas is also in the squad, guys. This is going to be a super interesting season, and we're not even close to being. Uh, oh, 8 for Marcella. To being, uh, you know, uh, done here. So it's going to be very, very much interesting. Right wing, uh, right mid, uh, slash right back, slash left mid, left back, left wing, you know. Um, don't forget to comment, guys, because Sanchez will not be left up. Trust me, have a plan for him. Hope you enjoyed this video, guys. As always, it's been a pleasure being your like, host of this video. And as always, if you enjoyed it, appreciate that like button. <laughs> it would so mean so much if you comment what you guys think about the video and you know about the co uh, the players, the signings, and everything. And as always, if you're new here and enjoy the content, please hit that subscribe button. And I will see you guys later. 